జనరల్ నాలెడ్జ్ లో మన విజ్ఞానాన్ని మరింత పెంచేందుకు టీసాట్ ప్రత్యేక కార్యక్రమం చేపట్టింది పలు అంశాలపై మనకున్న తెలివితేటల్ని పరీక్షించుకోవడం తెలియని అంశాలపై అవగాహన పెంచుకునేందుకు ఈ కార్యక్రమం రూపకల్పన చేసింది ఈ ప్రత్యేక క్విజ్ కార్యక్రమంలో మీరు పాల్గొనాలనుకుంటున్నారా మీ విజ్ఞానాన్ని మా ద్వారా ప్రపంచానికి పంచాలనుకుంటున్నారా అయితే మీ ప్రశ్నలు మరియు ఆప్షన్స్ మా టీసాట్ ఛానల్ పై నేరుగా సంధించండి లేదా ఈమెయిల్ కు పంపించగలరు ఫస్ట్ క్వశ్చన్ వాట్ ఈస్ ది ర్యాంక్ ఆఫ్ ఇండియా ఇన్ ది ఇంటర్నేషనల్ ఇంటలెక్చువల్ ప్రాపర్టీ ఇండెక్స్ ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ త్రీ ఆప్షన్ ఏ ట్వంటీ సిక్స్ ఆప్షన్ బి థర్టీ టూ ఆప్షన్ సి ఫార్టీ టూ ఆప్షన్ డి ఫిఫ్టీ ఫైవ్ యువర్ టైమ్ స్టార్ట్స్ నా ద కరెక్ట్ ఆన్సర్ ఈస్ ఆప్షన్ సి ఫార్టీ టూ ఇండియా ర్యాంక్స్ ఫార్టీ సెకండ్ అమాంగ్ ఫిఫ్టీ ఫైవ్ లీడింగ్ గ్లోబల్ ఎకనామీస్ ఇన్ ది ఇంటర్నేషనల్ ఇంటలెక్చువల్ ప్రాపర్టీ ఇండెక్స్ రిపోర్ట్ రిలీజ్ బై ది యుఎస్ ఛాంబర్స్ ఆఫ్ కామర్స్ ఇండియా వాజ్ ఎట్ ది ఫార్టీ ఎయిత్ ర్యాంక్ ఇన్ ది ఇయర్ ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ వన్ ద రిపోర్ట్ కవర్స్ పేటెంట్ అండ్ కాపీ రైట్స్ లా అబిలిటీ టు మానిటైజ్ ఐపీఎస్ఎట్స్ అండ్ ది రాటిఫికేషన్ ఆఫ్ ఇంటర్నేషనల్ అగ్రిమెంట్స్ మొరక్కో అండ్ థాయిలాండ్ అట్ టూ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ పర్సెంట్ ఈచ్ అండ్ వియట్నాం అట్ టూ పాయింట్ జీరో టూ పర్సెంట్ హ్యాడ్ ది లార్జెస్ట్ ఇంప్రూవ్మెంట్స్ ఇన్ దేర్ ఓవరాల్ స్కోర్ నెక్స్ట్ క్వశ్చన్ which country has launched a temporary salary support scheme and banned job cuts option a uk option b turkey option c ukraine option d china your time starts now the correct answer is option b turkey Turkey has launched a temporary salary support scheme and banned job cuts in the southern provinces that are hit by earthquakes. The devastating quakes killed over 42,000 people in the country as well as in the neighboring Syria. The government will provide salary support for employers in provinces under the safety of emergency. The government also banned layoffs in the earthquake zone except for some valid reasons. Next question. HD 3385 which has been developed by ICAR is a new variety of which species option A rice option B wheat option C mango option D sugar cane your time starts now the correct answer is option B wheat Indian Council of Agricultural Research has developed a new wheat variety which can overcome the challenges arising out due to changes in weather patterns and rising heat levels. This new wheat variety called HD 3385 is open to early sowing, escaping the impact of heat spikes and can be harvested before March end. Next question. Dibang multi-purpose project India's largest ever hydropower project is being set up in which state? Option A. West Bengal. Option B. Arunachal Pradesh option C Sikkim option D Uttarakhand your time starts now The correct answer is option B Arunachal Pradesh Dibang hydropower project which was approved by the central government recently is India's largest ever hydropower project. It is being set up close to China's border on the Dibang River in Arunachal Pradesh Lower Dibang Valley district. This project will be developed by National Hydroelectric Power Corporation with an estimated cost of 319 billion rupees. Next question. Yamunotri Dam is located in which state? Option A. Uttarakhand. Option B. Sikkim. Option C. West Bengal option D Bihar your time starts now The correct answer is option A Uttarakhand Yamunotri Dam is part of Char Dam the four famous Hindu pilgrimage sites in the Himalayas The other famous Hindu pilgrimages in the Himalayas are Gangotri, Kedarnath and Badrinath. The state government of Uttarakhand has inked a contract to construct a 3.38 km ropeway from Janki Chatti in Karsali to Yamunotri Dam. The ropeway will bring down the travel time and it is estimated to cost 166.82 crore rupees. Next question. Unique Identification Authority of India is a statutory body functioning under which union ministry? Option A Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology Option B Ministry of Home Affairs Option C Ministry of External Affairs Option D Ministry of Defence Your time starts now
The correct answer is option A, Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology. The Unique Identification Authority of India has recently launched a new security mechanism for Aadhaar-based fingerprint authentication. UIDAI is a statutory body that was established by the Indian government in January 2009. It comes under the aegis of Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology. Next question. International health regulations are associated with which institution? Option A. UNICEF Option B. Niti Aayog Option C. WHO Option D. Johns Hopkins University Your time starts now. The correct answer is Option C. WHO The first round of negotiations concerning the amendments to the WHO International Health Regulations 2005 concluded recently. More than 300 suggested changes were proposed for this document. The International Health Regulations 2005 is being implemented by 196 countries across the world. It is a binding instrument of international law that entered into the force in 2007. Next question. Which state is the host of race across India, Asia's longest ever cycle race? Option A. Sikkim Option B Madhya Pradesh Option C Maharashtra Option D Jammu and Kashmir Your time starts now The correct answer is Option D Jammu and Kashmir Race across India is Asia's longest ever cycle race. It was kicked off recently from Srinagar in the Union Territory of Jammu and Kashmir. The final destination of this first of its kind race is Kanyakumari, Tamil Nadu, covering a distance of 3655 kilometers. Geetha Rao is the only female participant in this race, which is being participated by 29 cyclists. She is India's first differently able super randonneur. Next question As per the periodic labor force survey report for 2021-22, what is the employment fraction in the farm sector? Option A: 26.5%, Option B: 32.5%, Option C: 45.5%, Option D: 55.5%. Your time starts now. The correct answer is Option C. 45.5%. The recently released annual periodic labor force survey report for 2021-22 shows that the farm sector employs a significant proportion of the labor force in India at 45.5%. Structural transformation in economics is a shift in labor force from agriculture to high productivity sectors like manufacturing and modern services. It is expected to result in increased productivity and higher incomes. Next question. Which country has proposed to create international big cat aliens? Option A: USA. Option B: India. Option C: Indonesia. Option D: Japan. Your time starts now. The correct answer is option B: India. India has proposed the creation of a new global aliens called the International Big Cat Aliens to protect seven major big cats including tigers, lions and cheetahs. The IBCA will be open to 97 countries and organizations interested in protecting these animals. India has committed to provide funding of 100 million US dollars over 5 years to support the IBCA. The IBCA will share information about protecting these animals. Its governance structure includes a general assembly and a council. Audience question Which is the first city ever to have hosted the Summer Olympic Games 3 times Option A Paris Option B Athens Option C London Option D Los Angeles Mention your answers in comment section Answer will reveal in comment section Mi samadhanalanu mariyu mi abhiprayalanu comments roopamlo teliyajeyandi మీరు టీసాట్ నుంచి ఎటువంటి కార్యక్రమాలను వీక్షించాలని అనుకుంటున్నారో ఈ క్రింది వాట్సాప్ నంబర్ ద్వారా మీ సందేశాలను పంచుకోగలరు వాట్సాప్ నంబర్ సెవెన్